Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my channel. This is Master Alex. Welcome. Today, I would like to share with you one of my experience happened in last year, which is in uh, December 29, 2021. So it's end of um, last year. And I remember it's a Wednesday morning. It's around like 9.30 a.m. At that time, uh, I'm running late for my office. And you know, it's uh, in the middle of the week. And it's a Wednesday uh, morning, so it's a whole bunch of things is waiting for me to do in the office. And then I have a few appointments I need to catch up. So at that time, uh, and I'm running late, so I'm quite nervous. And I keep driving, keep driving, and then I keep driving. All of a sudden, a police officer just pulled me over and he said that, Hey, you are driving too fast. You are driving like an unsafe uh, speed. And why me? this uh, ticket and, uh, and I take a look and what he said I'm driving too fast at that time that road is uh, like um, driving the speed limit is uh, 40 mile per hour but he said that he put it here is 55 mile uh, more than 55 mile per hour which is I'm uh, really really fast but I truly believe that I do not go speeding. I do not go over the limit. I may be, um, it's a 40 mile per hour. I may be hitting like a 40 or maximum is a 41 mile per hour, but definitely it's not this a 55. So I think it's not fair to me. And uh, so I cannot accept it. I get the ticket, I did not sign it. So I want to fight for my ticket. So that's why I use that I share with you guys use the date selection technique to help me to fight for this um, ticket. And let me show you. Um, I go to the website. The website called, is called uh, lacoach.com. And then I don't agree. Uh, I, don't, uh, I don't feel, um, I don't uh, agree I'm guilty for this uh, ticket. So I need uh, some like um, trial and arrangement day. And when I sign up everything, I need to choose a date for my arraignment. So at that time, it's a really simple. Just go to the court and say, hey, I'm not guilty. Then the judge will arrange a time for me to go for the trial. So, but that day is so important. So I use the technique that I share with you guys based on my own date of birth and then based on the good luck date of birth and then good luck date and then choose a lucky day on um, March. I do that. So I choose a lucky day on March and then um, pick it um, to go to the court. And at that time, for the time I go to the court, it's really, really smooth. Nothing special because just show up and say, hey, I'm not guilty, uh, your honor. And then I, I don't agree with that. Then he will arrange another day for me for the trial. But at that arraignment day, it's really, really lucky day for me. The timing is good for me. Everything's smooth. And then um, at this month, May, so I just uh, attend for the real court day, which is for the trial. And then at that time, the police officer supposed to come and then I supposed to go there and then we will do, um, we'll go together to, to, the, to the court and then um, I, I will defense one for myself. And really, really lucky. At that day, for the trial day, is also a lucky day for me. The timing is also good. And the more lucky thing is at that time, um, there's um, I remember it's a uh, 16 of uh, 15 people um, go over there, and not all the officers show up. So some of them is um, have dismissed it by the court for the case, and I am one of the lucky guy because my police officer did not show up, and then the judge just said, "Hey, okay, dismiss. Just pretend nothing happened. Just go home." So this ticket just. Uh, dismissed it. Uh, it's really, really lucky thing. So I used the lucky timing technique to help me to fight for this court case. For you, you can also do the same. Anything important, you need to schedule like a lucky timing for you, so you can have help you to have a better chance to success. Success. It may not be success a hundred percent, but at least you have more chance to success. So I also do some research based on my friends, my students, and then ask them to um, check for the date. Some of them is doing the sales job. They said that, 
hey, for their own lucky day, they have a more sales, more phone call, more sales they can close because of their lucky day. And for the bad luck timing, they have a, like a campaign, they have a, like a, the case, um, the business uh, um, uh, job for, for a while. So the timing is so important to us. And I keep checking with this, with me, with my friends and with my students. And we all agree that, hey, with using the good timing, it can help you a lot. Maybe you, you can also do the same thing, something the same. It's so simple. If you have anything about the timing, um, I have some video we talk about the timing and dates before. I put the link down below, you can check this out. Or if you have uh, any uh, um, question, any issue, just uh, let me know, I will help you, okay? I wish guys good luck. And make sure you use your lucky date to help you, okay? Thank you, thanks for watching. If you want to learn more about traditional feng shui setting and knowledge, I have a book in Amazon.com. The name is like Pedagogy Feng Shui 101. You can go there, take a look. I put a link down below. And if you want to learn more about current feng shui setting and yearly feng shui tips, I also have a book for you, free of charge. I put a link down below. You're welcome to go there, download it. And thanks for watching. Good luck.